The materials and tools needed for shower tray installation can be found in DIY shops or specialised building material outlets. The pavement or shower tray support base must be solid, dry and clean and perfectly levelled. A good option is to use ceramic pavement, which allows for fast, comfortable and clean work. For the making of the valve housing, measurements must be taken from the centre of the shower tray drain plug to be installed. If the shower tray is not yet available, request the technical characteristics from the distributor. Prepare a housing whose sides or diameter do not exceed 25 centimeters and whose minimum depth must be 7 centimeters for the horizontal outlet valve. A flexible 40 millimeter pipe must reach the housing from the household water mains to facilitate valve connection. Install the valve flush with its housing and check for water tightness. Place the shower tray and mark out its perimeter. Protect the perimeter surface with adhesive tape and the pavement outside the perimeter in order to avoid filler contamination. Prepare the mortar and fill the space around the valve making sure it is perfectly centred with respect to the shower tray drain hole to be fitted. Once the valve is fitted, apply a generous layer of polyurethane filler in the vertex of the walls with the shower tray perimeter. This cordon should give good water tightness between wall and shower tray. After application of perimeter sealant, prepare and apply generously low density fixing material to the base and extend evenly using a serrated spatula over all the base surface. Once fixing material is applied, install the shower tray. Protect the shower tray using cardboard from the packaging and compact it. The shower tray base must come into contact with the polyurethane filler applied to the base. Complete shower tray valve installation using the joints included and tighten down well to ensure water fastness. Fill in the remaining spaces around the perimeter of the shower tray and walls with polyurethane filler for maximum water tightness. Remove the protective adhesive tape carefully from the shower tray perimeter. Complete shaping with the shower tray well protected. Complete sealing with neutral silicone. Do not use acetic silicone as it may deteriorate the shower tray surface. Mark the profile drill holes on the wall using the level for accuracy. Drill holes and place plugs. Install the partition profile and screw in. Install the partition ceiling only outside, profile and glass. Use neutral non-acetic silicone only. 